we had an hitch with the, uh, the electricity. And then because we understand on the situation of the country, students took it like uh, it was an attack. And that's why we had the panic. A student has been killed and more than 100 injured in a stampede at a University of Nairobi campus after an electrical transformer exploded, triggering fears of an Al-Shabaab attack. Witnesses said the transformer blew up at about 4.30 a.m. on the morning of the 12th of April, setting off terrified screams from the women's wing of a dormitory at the Kikuyu campus hall of residence. The panic spread to the men's wing, where students woke up and scrambled to get out. They said the transformer went out in three loud blasts, plunging the dormitory into darkness before mayhem ensued. The student who died was among several who suffered serious injuries after jumping out of windows as high as five floors up in a panic. The stampede underlined growing tensions just over a week after gunmen from the Al-Qaeda-aligned group Al-Shabaab stormed Garissa University College, about 200 kilometres, that's 120 miles, from the Somali border, killing 148 people. Al-Shabaab has killed more than 400 people on Kenyan soil in the last two years, including 67 during a siege at Nairobi's Westgate Mall in 2013. While Nairobi's hospital treats the injured, students from the Kikuyu campus have called on the government to do more to secure all universities. This may have been an accidental explosion, but they still live in fear of another terrorist attack.